do okay let's let's get let's get this done did let's get this done did more of like obviously uh, I'm thinking vain because I'm thinking turn shenanigans uh, for summon hmm the increased speed while my brave is less than initial brave might not be bad oh, okay he's weak to lightning so yeah they want you to use Ramu whatever let's just do one this is you do, 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 do. And we need a. I want one who's completed. There we go. So I've come across many Christy supports who don't have the weapon passive or the extension, and they just they just shot. They're all gonna go first. This sucks. Ugh, this sucks. It's... Okay. Uh, I can't. I'll be, I want to kill that. Um. There you go. I want to kill that. There. And he's just gonna go do its little crazy thing now, where it, it like threatens to blow up next turn. So if I can just deal with that one, you don't need to do anything special here. There we go. Save ability usage, you know, as much as we can. We don't want to go crazy with abilities here. To the point that I'm only going to use these skills now. Because Vayne's Pummel and Pummel Plus, they do decent damage. Like, I, I, I burned through a wave there. In that whole wave, I didn't use any abilities and I didn't use a single turn either. Gilgamesh is getting a turn. There we go. You need to be looking at me, not my friend Bane. What I hate about these enemies is all the animations they've got once the HP decreases and they add buffs to go see through all those animations. It's so annoying. Uh, I kind of don't want to use another force of will right now, to be honest. I'll be stalling with my EX, of course, but still. So at least I'm dealing a much better damage now, and this is just by equipping him his proper weapon. That's good. I'm, I'm, I'm happy with that. One thing I noticed with Vayne, obviously he burns through shield so quickly. I, I, I dare say Warrior of uh, um, Zack might be better alongside Vayne. Zack doesn't give Vayne like a shield buff, he applies them to himself and draws all the tar all the, the heat to, to Zack himself. I dare say he might be my better alongside Zack. So here we are, we're here, we're at the end. I um We're starting off with this of course. I I'm inclined to very quickly go into the summon of Minion Christus. But let's do a bit more HP damage to him first. Uh, all this is stuff, let's resist the damage we're about to take. Refresh everyone's shield and then let's just see what he does for his opening gambit. Flare star? Okay, standard fair. Okay, now let's uh, take away a load of his turns here. I'm saving these force of wills for you! <laughs> Do, 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 do. When do you think I should uh, pop the old summon? I'm going to this. I kind of want to do it early to stop him getting a load of turns, but he doesn't seem to be doing anything too dangerous right now, if that makes sense. Once I, once I see that he's going to, he's, he's targeting himself and he's going to use one of his energy gains, then I might do the old swap. Got to max brave. Why is just using things like flare? Then this really isn't a problem, to be honest. What what he's doing right now is not an issue. Uh, force of will again. Let's just get right back onto it. 
With his full, his full kit of um, abilities. Let's use another mock wave. Uh, Death Claw, because you've got the passive for it. Well, I've got the passive for it. Okay, so now on his next turn, he's going to um, to do the. Uh, one of the energy gains. So now is when I wanna, I wanna nuke him now. Do I load the damage to him now before he gets all of that stuff off? Let's start, uh, and of course, all of the delay. That's 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 the important thing. Do 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 do. Yep. Oh, I'm not quite reaching max brave. Uh, okay, now this is this is this is one of those moments where Vayne is going to use up like three of the four summon turns left. That's the only problem with Vayne. Sometimes I actually I swap Vayne out during the summon and use someone else. Okay, this is fine. This is going perfectly fine right now. Uh, yep, straight back into this. So Varian really does have like a cycle. Trio of Sephira will bring him right back in. Also, on Varian's EX Plus, Trio of Sephira does the whole unbreak and break thing that Force of Will does. Which of course is really cool. We should have one more Degenerator Whip left. Based on the turns left for the Crystal Support. If she even gets to it, she might not even get a chance to use it. Okay, well, she'll probably finish this. Okay, maybe not. <laughs> Hashtag maybe not. There we go. Yeah, not difficult. If there were two bosses there, then I feel like that would be a lot more difficult. A lot more difficult. Because it seems to have quite a decent amount of HP. That's that that smashed the target score. Did it with 67 turns to spare. We smashed it. <laughs> I wish you got some of like 10 tickets for clearing it. And that's the hardest thing that this mode has to offer. 